Hello. Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening. How are you doing today? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing so far today? Good? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How was your day? Did you have a good day? I hope you did. Yes, I have a nice day. And you? Terrific. Yes, I have a good day as well. A little bit sad because uh, my pet is, is really sick, but one day at a time. <laughs> so, <laughs> yes. nice of you to be here early. That's a very good thing of you. They have 19 connected, so we're going to start by checking attendance. So let's see. It is Rosario. It is Rosario is not here. It is probably not. Isaac Daniel. Isaac Daniel is not in the meeting. Okay, uh, let's continue. Jacqueline Juliana. I heard someone. Thank you so much, Jacqueline. Jaime Oswaldo. Jaime Oswaldo. It's not here. Okay, uh, Jacqueline Vanessa. Thank you so much. Jessica Marielos. Jessica Marielos. Se escucha una interferencia de Ricardo de Jesús Ramírez. Thank you so much for being mute. Thank you. Okay, so let's continue. So, Jose Samuel. Thank you, Jose. Katia Graciela. Present teacher. Thank you, Katia. Kevin Anthony. Kevin Anthony. Lisbeth Daniela. Present teacher. Thank you, Lisbeth. Marcos Javier. Present teacher. Thank you. Give me one second. No oh good. I think I lost this file. Mm. I think I will need to. It seems like a pen. I don't know why I cannot see the file. No veo otra vez el, el file. Just can me give me one second. Creo que es la barra de herramientas que se ha congelado. No. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, I had to close everything. Hmm. 
I'm going to continue checking. Okay. Luis Alonso. Present teacher. Thank you so much, Luis. Marcos Javier. Present teacher. Thank you, Marcos. Maria de Los Angeles. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Maria del Carmen Cepeda. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Maria Lucila Soto. Maria Lucila. Maria Magdalena Sigüenza. Maria Magdalena. Marvin Raimundo. Present teacher. Okay. Thank you, Marvin and uh, Maria Magdalena, right? Present teacher. Thank you so much. Miguel Angel. Miguel Angel Quintanilla. Dice que tiene problemas para ingresar. Oh, no ha ingresado. Okay, thank you so much. Bueno, vamos a esperar que se conecte más tarde. Nadia y Solina. Present teacher. Thank you, Nadia. A Oscar Armando. Present teacher. Thank you, Oscar. Reina Yamilet. Present teacher. Thank you, Reina. Ricardo de Jesús. Ricardo. Present, Thank you, Ricardo. Sandra Elizabeth. Present, Thank you. Sandra Amelia. Present, Miss. Thank you. Sandra Mabel. Present, Miss. Thank you. Tania Pamela. Tania Pamela. Vilma Ide. Present. Thank you. Wendy Abigail. Present, Miss. Thank you. Nancy Saray. I'm here. Thank you so much. Jamie Rosibel. I am here. Thank you so much, Jamie. So. Sure. Yes. Dice en el chat Iris Rosario que acaba de ingresar. Okay, let me check. It is Rosario. Mm -hmm. It is, it is, it is Rosario. Okay, es la primera de la lista. Ahorita la anotamos. Gracias. All right. So I think we can continue now with the class and I'm going to check attendance before we finish today's section. So to continue with the program, let me share screen with you. We're going to um, practice a conversation that we have in the material that you download. Okay, so here it is. All right, so the conversation is what soul like. We're going to listen to the recording and then we're going to practice. Let me share sound with you. Okay. Page three, exercise three, conversation. What's soul like? Part A, listen and practice. Sun He, this is David Garza. He's a new club member from Mexico. Nice to meet you, David. I'm Sun He Park. Hi. So you're from South Korea? That's right. I'm from Seoul. That's cool. What's Seoul like? It's really nice. It's a very exciting city. Okay, do you have any question about uh, vocabulary or pronunciation? Sure. Mm -hmm. What is the meaning? What 
so like. Oh, what so like? Yes. Uh, it's um, when you have that kind of question, it is asking for a description. In this case, it's asking for the description of this place. So, so like. Uh -huh. oh. So I think it's a part in South Korea. It says, um, what's so like? And it says, it's really nice. So when you have this question, it's asking for a description. For example, if I ask you, um, what's your mother like? I'm okay, asking teacher. for you your mother. Excellent question. Muy Thank bien, you, porque... teacher. Uh -huh. Excellent, you're welcome. Cuando vemos este like, y a veces tal vez por ahí van porque vemos like, y no es como preguntarle qué es lo que te gusta, ¿verdad? Sino que um, si ven está al final, es con el verbo to be y el like está al final. Entonces está pidiendo una descripción. En este caso de Seoul, que es una parte de Corea del Sur, I guess. What's Seoul like? Y si se fijan en la respuesta, no le gusta, ah, me gusta o algo así. Sino que le dice, it's really nice. Es, es muy bonito realmente. It's really nice. It's a very exciting city. Mm -hmm. Very good question. Thank you so much. Any other? No more questions? No okay. Question, uh, let's see. I'm going to play the recording again so you can practice at home. And as we did yesterday, we're going to do it without um, with the microphones mute to avoid uh, like uh, uh, different um, noises and background noise. So we are going to do it in mute and then we're going to practice in the main section. Page three, exercise three, conversation. What's soul like? Part A, listen and practice. Sun He, this is David Garza. He's a new club member from Mexico. Mexico. Nice to meet you, David. I'm Sun He Park. Hi, so you're from South Korea? That's right, I'm from Seoul. That's cool. What's Seoul like? It's really nice. It's a very exciting city. Okay, questions before we practice this? No questions? No, teacher. No question, teacher. Teacher, yes? me. Uh, mm -hmm. What is the meaning of exciting? Exciting is like fantastic. It's a similar in meaning as fantastic. Mm -hmm. Es como Thanks. decir emocionante. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Any other question before we practice it? No questions? Okay, do we have volunteers to role play this conversation? Raise your hands. Okay, I have Kevin and Katya. Okay, we're going to start with them and you, the rest of you, you can uh, keep your hands in raised, and then we're going to lower hand as you participate. Let's just start with Kevin and Katya. Okay. Teacher, son tres. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, that would be Kevin, Katia, and Jamie. Okay, teacher. 
Sound he. This is David Garza. He's a new club member from Mexico. Nice to meet you, David. I'm from I'm Sun He Park. Hi. So you are from South Korea? That's right. I'm from Seoul. That's cool. What's so like? It's really nice. It's a very exciting city. 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 Okay, Sorry. very good. Thank you so much for your participation. So, let's see, let's review. That is South Korea. Mm -hmm. Let's repeat, South Korea. And then this place is pronounced Seoul. Seoul. And let's see, exciting, exciting city. Okay, well done. Thank you so much for participating. Let's continue with Luis Alonso, Sandra, Amelia, and Jacqueline. Okay. So he, this is uh, David Garza. He's a new club mom, member from Mexico. Nice to meet you, David. I'm in some he park. Hi, so you from South Korea. That's right. I'm from Seoul. That's cool. What's Seoul like? It's really nice. It's a very exciting city. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Just remember Seoul. Seoul. What's Seoul like? Very good job. Thank you so much. Let's continue with Oscar Armando, Reina Yamilet, and Jacqueline Enriquez. Oh, Jacqueline acaba de participar, ¿verdad? Okay, so it will be Oscar Armando, Reina Yamilet, and Nadia Isolina. Um, I am I am Beth. Son he. This uh David Garza. He is a new club member from Mexico. Nice to meet you, baby. I am from Kinky Park. Hi, so you're from South Korea? That's right. I am from Seoul. That's cool. What do you like? It's, re it's really nice. It's a very exciting city. Okay, very good job. Yes, let's remember, exciting. 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 City. exciting city. Excellent, very good, Oscar. Thank you so much, all of you, for participating. Let's see who else is here. Let's lower hands. Uh, Me, teacher. Okay, good evening. I have Miguel and I need two more volunteers to practice with Miguel. Sandra, thank you. One more. Me, Nancy, teacher. Thank you so much. So let's listen. Miguel, Sandra Mabel, and Jancy Sarai. So he, this is David Garza. He is a new club member from Mexico. Nice to meet you, David. I'm Suhi Park. Let's continue. ¿Qué pasó? Creo Who que is David? Compañero, right? Hmm. Miguel, ahí está. Teacher. Sí, teacher. Mm -hmm. eh, problema con internet, teacher. Uh, no worries, Miguel. Si se oye como en cortado. Yo era el tercero, sí. Uh -huh. Hi, so you are from South Korea? South That's right. Korea. That's right. I'm from Seoul. That's cool. 
what's your life? It's really nice. It's a very exciting city. Okay, very good. Thank you so much for participating. And I have Jose Samuel. I saw you raise your hand, Jose. And I have Sandra Elizabeth, Jose Samuel. And I need one more. Me, teacher. Thank you. Go ahead. Eh, so, empezaría yo, ¿verdad? <laughs> oh, lo siento. Yes, you can start, no worry. Casi no escucho. Eh, bueno, empezaría yo. Son, he, yes. <laughs> this is David Garza. He's a new club member from Mexico. Nice to meet you, David. I'm Sonny Park. Hi, so are you from South Korea? That's right. I'm from Seoul. That's cool. What's Seoul like? It's really nice. It's a very exciting city. Okay, very good job. Thank you for participating. Uh, just keep in mind it's South, South Korea. And that's okay. Thank you so much for participating. Now let's continue what we have in the platform. Let's see the next video. So here it is. Uh, let me share again. Hmm. All right, the next video is about the yes, no questions and short answers with B. I guess that you were having some troubles with the exercise related to this topic. So we're going to watch the grammar focus and then we're going to practice and complete the exercises from the platform. By the end of this lesson, participants will be able to make yes-no questions and give short answers with B. Yes-no questions and short answers with B. Are you free? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Is David from Mexico? Yes, he is. No, he's not. No, he isn't. Is Beth's class in the morning? Yes, it is. No, it's not. No, it isn't. Are you and Beth in the same class? Yes, we are. No, we're not. No, we aren't. Are your classes interesting? Yes, they are. No, they're not. No, they aren't. Take a look at the questions in the chart again. Are you free? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Is David from Mexico? Yes, he is. No, he's not. Or no, he isn't. See the structure of the questions. B plus subject plus complement plus question mark. Keep in mind the verb be will depend on the subject we're talking about. Also, when answering an affirmative, you have to always say yes, he is. Yes, we are. Yes, you are. Your answer should not be just yes. You do the same with negative answers. When your answer is no, you have to answer by saying no, he's not, or no, he isn't. No, they're not, or no, they aren't. Wow, this is a conversation that we already practiced. And then we watch this video about the statements would be, um, well, it's not this one, it's 
I don't know why it's not here. <laughs> okay, it's just no questions with B and you were practicing an exercise related to that topic, right? So, vi que tenían problemas con este ejercicio. So, we're going to complete it together here. Let me share it again. Okay, uh, so let's complete this one and then uh, let's continue with this. It says be possessive adjectives, but I'm not sure if it is the one that you were completing. Oh, it was this one. Este fue en el que estaban teniendo problemas. Está relacionado al video que acabamos de ver. Eh, las just no long answers with be. Y como decía en el video, eh, siempre hay que usar la respuesta completa. Si vamos a contestar afirmativo es yes, coma, y luego el sujeto con el que estamos preguntando, ¿verdad? Yes, I am. Uh, yes, he is. Yes, she is. Yes, they are, etc. If it's negative, remember, we need to put no, and then a coma. I am not. No. You are not, and so on. So let's try to complete this exercise. I saw that some of you were um, working on this. Some of you were able to do it. So how would you have here? It says, uh, responde las preguntas sobre usted. Okay, dice sobre usted, pero creo que no reconoce si lo hacemos sobre nosotros, ¿verdad? Ese fue uno de los problemas. Recuerde colocar el punto al final. Are you from United States? ¿Cómo les quedó hasta el final? No, no, I am not from the United States. Okay, no, I am not from United States. Okay. The, the United States. The United. The United. Thank you so much. And then I think that I need to use capital letters here. Okay, no, I am not from the United States. And then, is your teacher from Canada? No, she is not from Canada. Okay, no, she is not from Canada. Is your English class in the morning? No, it's not in the morning. Teacher. Yes. Al final de la oración, el punto, ¿verdad? Uh, yes, according to the instructions, okay. yes. Mm -hmm. No, it is not in the morning. And the last one, are you and Be your sure. best friend? Uh -huh. and, and the three, uh, a mí, yo puse no irisen y me salió buena, solo esa, solo esa respuesta. Ok, vamos a chequear. A veces hay más de alguna opción. Vamos a ver si nos acepta esta. Uh, and the last one, are you and your best friend the same age? Yes, yes we, yeah, are. we are. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Ay, se puso mayúscula. Yes, we are. Ok, and the... That at the end. Okay, so it accepted all the answers that we provided. Okay, so nos las aceptó así, como ustedes indicaron. La número uno sería no, coma, I'm not from the United States. Number two, no, she's not from Canada. Number three, no, it is not in the morning. Oh, bueno, en el caso de la compañera que le aceptó, no, it is not, hasta ahí, pueden probar también. And number four, yes, we are. And then, uh, this is like, you must have it. Espero que les ayude a los que todavía no les salía así. No sé si tienen alguna duda o pregunta con esto. No questions. No question, teacher. 
No oh, question. Okay. So we're going to continue with the material that we have here. And now we have the next thing here. It's the video about statements with B plus possessive adjectives. So we're going to go ahead and watch the video and see how do we use possessive adjectives. By the end of this lesson, participants will be able to understand and use possessive adjectives. My, your, his, her, its, our, their. Today, we will go over the possessive adjectives. Let's listen and look at the chart. Statements with B. Possessive adjectives. Statements with B. I'm from Mexico. You're from Brazil. He's from Japan. She's a new club member. It's an exciting city. We're in the same class. They're my classmates. Contractions of B. I'm equals I am. Your equals you are. He's equals he is. She's equals she is. It's equals it is. We're equals we are. They're equals they are. Possessive adjectives. My. Your. His. Her. It's. Our. Their. I want you to pay attention to the possessives. In English, each person has its own possessive. So remember, I, my, you, your, he, his, she, her, it, its, we, our, they, their. For example, we say, my family, his mother, her car, our brother, and so on. Okay, that was the video about possessive adjectives. Is that clear or do you have any questions of this topic? Is it easy? You feel that's difficult? What do you think? It's easy. Easy. Okay. Easy, sorry. Okay. And the rest of you, what do you think? I think easy, teacher. Okay. Easy. Very oh. easy, I think. Very easy. Nice. Okay, so let's practice. And we have to complete in this part we have here. Uh, this is what we already listened and watch the explanation of this grammar focus the statements would be the contractions and the possessive adjectives they are related with each pronoun for example if i am talking about something that is that belongs to me the possessive adjective will be my if i'm talking about something that belongs to you the possessive adjective would be your and so on. If it's about he, it's, it's his. For she, the possessive is her. For it, the possessive is it. And remember, no, no apostrophe here because this is possessive adjective. So we don't need the apostrophe here. We, the possessive is our. And they, the possessive is their. So let's complete these sentences and care about ourselves. I'm going to give you some time for you to complete this and then we're going to check together.
Have you finished the exercise? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, teacher. Uh, volunteer for the number one, raise your hand. Me, teacher. Okay, I saw Kevin's hand. Vi la manita de Kevin. Kevin. Sí, teacher. Okay, can you give us the number one, please? Okay. My name is Mario Kiruma. I am from Japan. Uh, my family, my family is in Osaka. My brother is a university student. His name is Kenji. Excellent. Very well done. Those are the answers. Thank you so much. A volunteer for number two, raise your hand, please. Maria Magdalena, thank you. Uh, my name is Antonio. I'm from Buenos Aires. It's a really nice city. My sister is a student here too. My parents are in Argentina right now. Okay, my parents uh, or our parents? Our parents. Our parents. Our parents. Uh -huh. uh, Excellent. Yeah. Thank you so much for participating. Let's see, Jamie, number three. The number three is I am Catherine, but everyone calls me Katie. My last name is Martin. I'm a student at City College. My parents are on vacation this week. It is in Los Angeles. Uh, the last one, it is my parents are on vacation this week. It is mm. Los Angeles. No. Uh, uh, can somebody help her with the last part? T-shirt. Mm -hmm. And parents are on vacation this week is our parents. Or my parents. And that's okay. My parents are on they, vacation. They are in Los Angeles. They, uh huh. Okay, thank you, teacher. Yes, just the last part. Excellent job. Okay, to practice a little bit more with the possessive adjectives, we're going to go the extra mile. How does it work? As I told you before in, in the previous class yesterday, um, I include some extra exercises for you to practice. In this case, we are going to practice the possessive adjectives. We have three links, uh, uh, so we're going to uh, visit these three links. You can share the screen in groups and you can solve them together. Visit the links, uh, share the screen and provide with the answers for the four exercises, okay? Are we clear on this? Are they... I have a question. Mm -hmm. uh, you can send the presentation in the group WhatsApp. Mm -hmm. WhatsApp. Yes, it's the same as yesterday. Sí, pero creo que se unieron más después de que compartí la presentación, ¿verdad? Um, so we're going to share that again. And the, and the screen... Um, La pantalla, la captura de pantalla, nos... la vamos a mandar al grupo entonces. Uh, no, de hecho que solo es práctica que van a hacer en grupo. Ahorita les comparto. Ok, ahí está nuevamente la presentación. Ahí tienen esta partecita en donde van a hacer esos ejercicios, van a visitar el link. Uh, son cuatro enlaces, cada enlace contiene ejercicios con los possessives que acabamos de ver. Entonces los van a ir resolviendo en grupo. Eso es una práctica extra relacionada al tema. Ahí tienen la presentación y igual pues lo voy a copiar. Puedo copiarles acá, déjenme dejar de compartir para poder copiar. Ok. Un second. Uy, no me deja copiarlos. 
Bueno, si ¿sí tienen acceso en el WhatsApp group, ¿verdad? Yes. Ok. Yes, teacher. Ok. Um, teacher. Uh -huh. eh, ahí los copié en el chat por si... Ah, ok. Para tenerlo Excelente. más accesibles. Ajá, así tal vez, porque a veces me dicen que están desde el celular y están con la mirin también. Entonces, bueno, ahí están ya los, los enlaces. Los voy a poner en grupo. Alguien del grupo puede compartir pantalla para que todos vayan. Eh, ustedes van a decidir su dinámica, ¿verdad? Si dicen en el grupo está Samuel, Jamie, Wendy, pues ser, ok, Samuel, hace vos el uno. Jamie, ¿qué pensás? ¿Cuál es la respuesta en el dos? Wendy, ¿cuál es el tres? Y así. El mismo enlace les da para que chequen sus respuestas a ver si son correctas o no. Ok, so vamos a hacer esta práctica en grupo y ahí se pueden ir como retroalimentando el tema que acabamos de ver, que son los possessive adjectives. Así que lo vamos a hacer en grupo. Let's join the groups.
Uma solta está pensando que ele vai cair e foi para a sua Hey Jessica, were you in our room? Or you just got disconnected? Let's see.
Let's just wait for the rest to finish. Did you finish all the exercises? Yes, sure. Yes. Were they easy or difficult? Yes. Easy. It's very easy. Okay. It's nice to hear that. It means that you understood the topic very well. Yeah, that's good to know that. All right, I think that everybody's back again in the main section. So I'm just going to check attendance for the ones who didn't have a present mark from the beginning of the class. So let me just pull out the file from uh, our drive. Okay, let's let's check. Is that Daniel? Is not in? Jaime Oswaldo? Jessica Marielos? Present teacher. Thank you, Jessica. Kevin Anthony? Kevin Anthony? Present teacher. Thank you, Kevin. Maria Lucila? Maria Lucila is not in. Okay, so let's continue with Miguel Angel Quintanilla. Miguel Angel Quintanilla. Okay, Tania Pamela. Present, Miss. Thank you, Tania. And uh, okay, so it's just three before people miss in today's class. So good. Uh, thank you so much for joining. So unfortunately, time is over for us. I'm going to see you tomorrow for more and I hope to see every one of you. Try not to miss classes. See you tomorrow. Thank you, Good night. 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 Good